hydrogen is not only the most prevalent element in the universe, it holds immense potential as a source of clean, renewable energy. It's like harnessing the power of the stars in your vehicle. However, like all technologies, hydrogen fuel cells have their downsides. Currently, large-scale hydrogen production is expensive and can require significant energy, sometimes from non-renewable sources. Plus, the infrastructure for hydrogen refueling is less widespread than for gasoline or even electric charging, though this is rapidly changing. Now, let's turn back the clock and revisit Honda's previous venture into this intriguing technology. In 2015, Honda released the Clarity Fuel Cell Vehicle, or Clarity FCV for short, a futuristic car that hinted at the immense potential of hydrogen power. The Clarity was a technical marvel, representing Honda's bold vision for a sustainable future. Yet, despite its innovative tech, the Clarity failed to gain widespread acceptance and was discontinued in 2021. The reasons? Limited infrastructure for hydrogen refueling and the high cost of hydrogen fuel cells were two significant hurdles. However, the landscape is rapidly evolving. Hydrogen refueling stations are becoming more common, making hydrogen cars a more viable option. And this brings us back to Honda's exciting announcement a hydrogen fuel cell version of the popular CRV SUV, set to launch in 2024 in North America and Japan. This new SUV promises to merge the best of two worlds, the practicality and popularity of the compact SUV and the sustainability and innovation of hydrogen fuel cells. Honda co-developed this fuel system with General Motors making this vehicle a collaborative effort at the frontier of automotive technology. The new fuel cell system is expected to feature a power export function, which is generating considerable excitement. This function could allow the CRV to serve as a mobile power source. Imagine powering your home during a blackout or your tools at a remote worksite straight from your car. Honda anticipates manufacturing about 2,000 hydrogen fuel cell vehicles annually starting in 2025 and ramping up production to 60,000 units per year by 2030. That clearly signals their commitment to hydrogen technology and a sustainable future. But Honda's vision continues beyond cars. They plan to sell their fuel cell system to partners in the transportation and industry sectors further expanding the reach of this revolutionary technology. Now, let's compare hydrogen fuel cell vehicles with electric vehicles and traditional gas-powered cars. Firstly, let's talk range and refueling. This is an area where hydrogen fuel cell vehicles genuinely shine. Typical EVs give you a range between 150 to 370 miles depending on the model and battery size. But when the juice runs out, charging times can vary from 30 minutes at a supercharging station to 12 hours or more with a home charger. That's ample time to binge watch the entire Lord of the Rings trilogy in one sitting. In contrast, hydrogen-powered cars like the upcoming Honda CRV can offer comparable, if not better, range than most EVs. In addition, refueling a hydrogen car could take as little as 3 to 5 minutes, no longer than your typical gas station stop. So if you're on a cross-country road trip, Honda's hydrogen SUV might just be your right of choice. Now, how about the environmental impact? Both hydrogen fuel cell vehicles and EVs produce zero tailpipe emissions. However, the manufacturing process for battery-powered EVs can be carbon-intensive. Mining metals like lithium, cobalt, and nickel for EV batteries often involve significant energy consumption, contributing to a higher initial carbon footprint for electric vehicles. On the other hand, while hydrogen fuel can be produced using natural gas, it can also be made using renewable energy sources to separate water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen through a process called electrolysis. 
This means hydrogen fuel promises to be a completely clean energy source from production to consumption. Imagine a world where your car's only emissions are water vapor. But it's not all rosy for hydrogen cars. The current hydrogen infrastructure is relatively limited compared to EV charging or gas stations. However, as mentioned earlier, this landscape is rapidly changing and more hydrogen refuel stations are installed daily. Still, why would consumers choose hydrogen over the already established EV market? Well, hydrogen fuel cells have a significant advantage when long-range and quick refueling is crucial. Think about commercial vehicles like trucks, buses, or taxis, which must stay on the road as much as possible. Honda's intent to sell its fuel cell system to other industry sectors suggests they understand this potential too. Even in the personal car market, hydrogen could be a game changer for people living in apartments or without access to home charging who currently struggle with EV ownership. With the convenience of quick refueling, a hydrogen car could fit seamlessly into their lifestyle, just like a gasoline car but without carbon emissions. And let's not forget the power export function we mentioned earlier. While EVs can also supply power back to the grid or a home, the higher energy density of hydrogen fuel means a fuel cell car like the Honda CRV could potentially provide even more power. Now, hydrogen's energy density is a remarkable attribute that is worth discussing in greater detail. In simple terms, Energy density refers to the amount of energy that can be stored in a given substance. We deal with an extraordinarily high energy density when we're talking about hydrogen. In fact, per kilogram, hydrogen has nearly three times the energy content of gasoline. That's equivalent to packing the power of three gallons of gasoline into a one gallon container if we compare on a weight basis. So you see, in terms of sheer energy holding capacity, hydrogen is a heavyweight champion. But what does this really mean for hydrogen vehicles, you may wonder? Well, high energy density translates into a couple of significant benefits. Firstly, it can enable a greater range. This is why hydrogen fuel cell vehicles, like the upcoming Honda CRV, can rival or even exceed the range of many gasoline cars and even outdistance most EVs. With hydrogen's high energy density, these vehicles can store more energy in less weight, which is a huge advantage when you're trying to design a lightweight, efficient vehicle. Secondly, hydrogen can deliver more power for extended periods because of this high energy density. Remember the power export function of the Honda CRV we spoke about? This is where it comes into play. With hydrogen's high energy density, a fuel cell vehicle can provide power not just to drive the car but to power external devices or even homes for a considerable time. Imagine a future where your car isn't just a vehicle but a mobile power source capable of providing energy wherever you need it. Going camping? Power your equipment with your car. Power outage at home? No problem, your car's got your back. So we're discussing more than just an interesting fact when discussing hydrogen's energy density. We're talking about a property that could redefine our relationship with vehicles, transform them from mere means of transport to versatile power sources, and open up a world of possibilities. That's the world hydrogen cars could help us build. A world where technology enhances our lives and our environment rather than harming it. A world where our energy comes from the most abundant element in the universe and returns to the earth as water, the source of all life. That's the power and the promise of hydrogen. And that's why you should be excited about Honda's hydrogen-powered CRV and the future of hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. So what does this mean for the automotive industry? It represents another step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future where our cars run on abundant renewable energy sources. The success of Honda's CRV could encourage other manufacturers to explore hydrogen technology, leading to more options for consumers 
and further growth of the hydrogen infrastructure. As for Honda investors, this venture into hydrogen technology is a bold, future-forward move. It shows Honda's commitment to innovation and sustainable energy, which are becoming increasingly important to consumers. If Honda can overcome the challenges that plagued the clarity, they could secure a leading position in the emerging hydrogen car market, potentially driving growth for years to come. So stay tuned whether you're an investor looking for the next big thing or just a tech enthusiast excited about the future. Hydrogen technology can potentially revolutionize the automotive industry and the broader energy sector, and it's a ride you don't want to miss. Remember, our future is powered by our choices today. So choose wisely, invest smartly, and always look forward. As always, we're eager to hear your thoughts. So let's continue the discussion in the comments section below. Do you believe that hydrogen fuel cars have the potential to become mainstream? And if you found this video helpful, please subscribe to our channel and give us a like. Until next time, stay curious, excited, and charged for the future.